Check your progress, the digestive system. Use the words in the box to complete the sentences above digestion, mouth, stomach, small intestine, esophagus and large intestine. The first sentence is, food is pushed down the esophagus into the stomach. In the small intestine, the food is broken down into very small particles. The food is mixed with digestive juices in the stomach. Undigested food is pushed out of the body through the end of the large intestine. Last, the food is chewed in the mouth. The sentences in question 1 are in the wrong order. Sort them into the correct order of the stages of digestion. The first sentence should be, the food is chewed in the mouth, because chewing of food in mouth is the first stage in digestion. Food is then pushed down the esophagus into the stomach. The food goes through the esophagus into the stomach, so that's the second step. The food is mixed with digestive juices in the stomach. In the small intestine, the food is broken down into very small particles. And the last stage is, undigested food is pushed out of the body through the end of the large intestine. Decide if each of these statements are true or false. We get energy from carbohydrates. True. We need to eat fat to help us grow and build our bodies. False. Fiber in our food gives us energy. False. We can drink juice and cola instead of water. False. Fruits and vegetables contain lots of vitamins and minerals. True. Calcium helps to make our teeth and bones strong. Arun had noodles, chicken, an orange and a cola drink for lunch. Which food helps him grow? It's chicken because it contains protein. Which food helps him gain energy? It's noodles because noodles contain carbohydrates. Which food gives him vitamins and minerals? Orange because it's a fruit so it's rich in vitamins and minerals. Identify two foods he can change to make his meal healthier. Give a reason for your answer. He could switch noodles and cola drink with healthier foods. Noodles and cola are junk foods that are not nutritious.
Mrs. Patel went to the supermarket. She couldn't decide if she should buy a can of butter beans or a can of creamed corn. Look at the table of the two cans and answer the questions. Which food has the most protein? It's butter beans. Which food has the most sugar? Creamed corn. Name two minerals found in the canned foods. It's calcium and iron. Which can should Mrs. Pato choose as part of a balanced diet? It should be butter beans. Explain your answer to D. Butter beans have the essential nutrients such as protein, carbohydrates, fiber, calcium and iron in high amounts unlike creamed corns, where the essential nutrients are in lesser amounts.